for an infringement on Anas Mohamed. Of course, Anas Mohamed, wow, goalkeeper could not do anything about it, it is 11, 10, and he injured himself, goalkeeper injured himself right there, trying as much as possible to, trying as much as possible to save that one, it stretched out, but um, somehow was not able to get that goalkeeper Ababori Samuel Uh, goalkeeper Samuel leaving to the treatment table and replacing him is uh, Jason number one Mukail Puad. Yes, Puad replaces him. Is Rima Strikers 10 Soldier Marine 11 and of course that jump shot didn't do anything and of course yes how is it gonna be yes Anas Mohammed scored that it is 11 apiece That's what's going to happen on the treatment table. game so far no doubt fantastic performance from the two teams eleven eleven Just to see how the first half did come to a close. 11 11 on the scoreboard for both teams. Sokoto Rima 11, Tojere, Tojere Marines 11 in this encounter. Really, really a well competitive game. You just couldn't have imagined how difficult this contest would have been. But it's interesting to see how both teams have come to the party and how they've managed to contribute 11 goals apiece in this interesting occasion.
and this, of course the second half is about to commence between Tuji Marine and uh, Rima Strikers of Sokoto now it is 11-11 it was an explosive first half a great first half a wonderful first half a first half that um, was so colorful uh, full of fireworks that was how it was right there at the velodrome of the uh, national stadium in Abuja Toja Marine commencing of course yes sir the second half and for the next 30 minutes we are going to see some of the best yes right here it is 11 11 and of course yes uh, Toja Marie threw that away over the bar let's see whether there's gonna be so much of uh, uh, insightful goal scored right here And of course, yes, strikers said uh, there was a slip there and asked Mohamed, yes, had a slip there and it is advantage. To Jamarin. course yes sir it is traveling right there and of course Rima strikers have an opportunity they still have and the referee has called for an infringement to nine meters and two minutes suspension for a striker player and I was wondering what it is to deserve a two minute suspension there Sulaiman Usman who was wondering what he did so for now for the next two minutes Rima strikers will play with um, few men uh, or a man short yeah for the next two minutes I am Samuel Amadou here and of course certainly we're here to ensure that we give you all of the best and of course a jump shot and a goal and that's Mohamed and of course a draw yes fast break from Toja Marine and they scored as well number seven Jesse did that in Grand Sly at GBK Karim it is 12 12 And of course there's a seven meters through yeah it is uh advantage rima strikers yes who takes this one number 11 shattered player hazan sunny and of course he scores it is 13 12. yes so far so good the referees from kogi state uh Amade, Steven and Zikari Saliu are taking charge of this game and of course it's actually going real well there. He has a jump shot but the goalkeeper was able to get through it. A fast break. Strikers. And a nice save as well from goalkeeper. From goalkeeper Mukala Quad fast break and of course but uh, nothing to show for it than uh, seven meters IGBK Karim was fouled there and of course there's a seven meters 
for Toje Marine. And who takes it? Kuti Kurede. Kuti Kurede. Kuti Kurede. And of course, he scores. It is 13 to 10. Of course, the score is 13 13. Yes, the score is 13 13 at the moment. Now 14 13 because uh, strikers are leading in this one. Another one, of course, and of course, goalkeeper saved that one. Fast break was stopped. So, stay continues as well. Yes, and of course, he's fouled. Nine meters is fouled. Ajibike Karim. Yes. And two minutes suspension for number 44. Again, Suleiman Usman. Now, if he gets another two minutes suspension, he is going to be evicted from this match with a red card. Mm -hmm. And of course, yes, yeah, a good goal, a good goal. Two minutes again for number nine, Jesse Player for Strikers. His name is um, Buari Usman. It is 15, 13. Understand is fifteen twelve. Toja Marine leading in this one. Still a very interesting game if you ask me. Really, really interesting. He has a two minute suspension for number 99 for Trojan Marine. His name is Belo Daniel. Oh, he missed it. He missed the seven meters. Yes, he missed it. Number 11 player, uh, Azan Sunny. Missed it. And time out. Okay, so it means uh, fifteen. The scoreline, in case you are confused, is 
Sokoto 13. Toje Marin 15. And of course, yes, uh, he couldn't score that one. First two minutes, you know, my third team. Now, Sokoto, of course, uh, playing with the full strength of their team at the moment. And of course, yes, uh, number 16, Shepard, uh, number 66, Shepard player, Joseph Ikwekire scoring that. Yes, and of course, a nice pass, a goal, 16-14. The strikers are really playing with so much vigor. Yes, and of course, a good goal. It is 15 16. It is 15 16. A good goal from number 14, shadow player Belu Mohamed. Toji Marine. Exciting team. Playing very excitingly. But of course, I uh, can lose focus at some point. We can lose focus. Hanas Mohamed. Yes. And of course, uh, he played that one, but of course, uh, it was tough. And it is advantage to the Marine. The fast break. Yes, in goes in. And oh, did he not take that? How did he not take that? Hanas Mohamed again. And of course, yes, they scored. It is now 16 16. What an exciting game this is turning out to be. A timeout quickly called by <laughs> Coach Bright and Gubata. And of course, yes, there's so much to talk about on how they can, you know, salvage something from this game. Summer model, this is trying. This is not trying. This is certainly. A very interesting game and it's showing that um, these two sides are very exciting and anything can come out from this game yeah most definitely like we did uh, spoke about earlier in the game uh, Sokoto Rima were trying to put on display their character uh, their the quality experience of especially playing uh, in the top five for a couple of seasons and now uh, they've they managed to use that in the early stages but unfortunately uh, you see the character and the comeback uh, great comeback spirit put on display by also uh, the, the, the young and athletic uh, Toje Marine side and I think this really speaks for about how desperate they are, how ambitious they have. Uh, getting into the tough light, you know that yes, they really have a lot on their, their sleeves and desperate to really prove their points in the tough light. So uh, one wouldn't be surprised to see what difference they've made so far and how well they can go far. Less than, 20 minutes to Less than 20 minutes for the end of this game and it is still 16-16. Yes, 9 meters. And of course a jump short as well saved by the goalkeeper Abbas Mohamed. A long throw. Of course Summer it was able to get an infringement for his team. Advantage to Jamarine. And of course, uh, trying to ensure they pass through that one as well. It's still a very dicey one here, yeah, if you ask me. Really, really dicey. Really dicey. 
And of course, the Joshua Botti hits the bar. And it is advantage to the Marine again. Again, somehow, his uh, pinpoint shots was not safe. That fast break was caught at GBK uh, by number six player Kuti Kuridi. Stopped that fast break from going any further. It's still 16 16. Who breaks the ice here? It is an infringement against uh, Rima Strikers of Sokoto. And of course, yes, it's still an infringement outside of the arc. And they could not score. Rima Strikers trying to see whether they can get something from this game. And of course, yes, sir, it is advantage again of uh, Toji Marine. Advantage Toji Marine. And of course, yes, it scores. Number 99, Akinlade. Um, Belo Daniel scores that. But the player is down. The player is down. The player is down. But, you know, game is still ongoing. The player is down. Hopefully, that player is um, actually really fine. It is 6 16 16 and they have played for more than five minutes. No goal yet. Sam. Yeah, well, it's really exciting to see how KGD's account has been and, you know, both teams uh, really digging deep and staying true to their, to their strategy and also to their game plan. It's amazing, definitely, how the coaches have managed to execute their, their game plan. For me, I think it's commendable. This is definitely highlights. Uh, on the start of day uh, for this league season and impressive what we've seen. Uh, Toya Marines have really stepped up to the plate and also shown that they are also good enough to compete in the top flight and this great display definitely shows how much of a policy they do deserve being in the top flight. Apparently the player that was down is Bilu Daniel. Yes, let's see if we'll be able to come back from Ooh. this one. Let's see how this pans out. Strikers continuing from where they left off from. You can hear the coach shouting, and of course, yes, strikers take the lead. After a while, Toja Marine. Ensuring that they continue with uh, the way they have been trying as much as possible to be penetrative. They are on the arc. And of course, yes, number three shattered player, yes, was brought down. Yaya Latif and it is seven meters who we'll also take it down Kuti Kuridi and of course yes sir uh, a goal is called
somehow there was a traveling right there and it is advantage to Jamari 15 minutes more to go in this game and let's see what's come out in the next 15 minutes 17 17 and of course yes sir a foul seven meters again and Kuti Akwiridi would have to take it again with his magnificent uh, left hand and of course this scores Abbas Mohamed did not even think about it it is 18-17 I mean, with the way Toje Marie is playing, as I said, it would certainly remind you of last season. Our Doribu Angel started and didn't lose a game. And of course, some exciting young players, young guys, and they are holding their own well against experienced uh, Rima striker side. Yeah, well, it's it's really not easy, you know, playing a tough fight, especially on the first game, and you know, really uh, doing pretty well. Uh, well, a, a chance to uh, find the back of the net from the seven meters, and he did convert that Sokoto Rima again on level terms. It's unbelievable how they are really pulling out the way. That will be Buari Usman, and it is now 18 18. We're going to have a drain this one. It's really, really, really tightly contested, more like a family affair, I must say. And now these two teams seem to be getting behind each, uh, each other's defense pretty often all through the game. Uh, seem like they look inseparable, but we definitely will have to wait the last minute to decide how things will pan out between these two sides. It is 18 18, and of course, an infringement right there. Advantage to Jamarine. To Marine. Very exciting things going on right here. And of course, yes, sir, you can now see the way Bright uh, Ugubata, the coach of this side, has been able to set up his team. And of course, yes, it's the bye again. And, you know, he almost told that. Toja Marine. I'm in trouble right now because it is now 1918. Yes, 1918. Number 14 player Javan Jafan scoring that one. Wow, the least the legs and of course yes sir. The referee calls back the ball. This is how things are going right here at the Abuja. Lovely goal, Anas Mohamed. Now they lead with two goals. 2018. Toji Marine at the moment for the first time in this match are two goals down. You know, this tells me that probably the most consistent team, Sam, will probably win this one. If I come to you, Sam. Of course, uh, Rima Strikers have an opportunity to increase and of course they did so. Now Toja Marine are three goals down. Mm. Slowly and almost surely, it seems Sokoto Rima are taking this one. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, they, they are really pulling away and uh, how they're doing that, you know, bringing on display, no doubt, the quality of experience they've garnered. Uh, over the years competing in the top flights, uh, competing in the top division and in a league, very competitive league like the Prudence Energy Abroad League. They are pulling one back, seem not likely to count. Uh, unfortunately, really, for Jogeri Mans. And a chance, attacking chance 
Well, Liman is just it. Unless Mohamed again he has been the factor right here, he has ensured that the time this one in the last three minutes he has been involved in all of the goal. Less than 10 minutes to go, it is 22 18. How is this going to pan out? Yes, sir. We fouled in that one. Yes, sir. Foluki Christian foul. And of course, yes. He was able to score. It is 22 19. Timeout called by strikers. Yes, they lead this one with three goals. This has turned the table. From the beginning of the game, they were drawing with each other. But at the moment, Sam, it is a three goals advantage for Rima Strikers of Sokoto. How do you think this panned out? Yeah, well, I think uh, Toje Marines are really doing everything possible to, to remain uh, very much in the mix. At least it's still. Uh, open and they can definitely fight back to really gain control. Well, we remember from the start, they were they, they started uh, on the back for three goal uh, behind and they did bang back, leveled and even opened a two goal lead at the start. Now we need to see how best uh, their late fighting spirits can be really brought to bear and at least we we'll see the quality they put, uh, they, they've really shown while playing at the uh, the, the, the for second division, I think this will really be a big test really for their wrestlers and again for the character they do possess and we do really know them for. So it's really a chance for them. They need to, have to keep fighting. Tojeri must get it intercepting their pass and they have a chance to really make a pass straight into the area. But unfortunately, a clash there and a foul inside the area definitely going to give them uh, the position of the game still. And they still have control here. Attacking opportunities still very much in play. They definitely will look to uh, fight every opportunity to really keep themselves brightly in the mix in this game. Well, no doubt a tough contest for them. And uh, no surprise, they really should have anticipated such an interesting contest. Sokoto Rima, a well oil side and organized to they really stayed in very strongly and we expect to get to really respond squarely. Well and of course yes sir in the still 22 19 Sokoto Rima strikers winning this one with of course that slide let's 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 look at um the, some of your comments and see how things pans out and this one Yes, sir. let's see how things pans out in this one with some of your comments. Yes. Yes, and of course it is. <laughs> it is a goal, the way this goal is just called. Yes, it is a goal, 23-19. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I mean, can we confidently say that this has ended? Well, it's really going to be too early to tell. Uh, we, we obviously still have a couple of minutes, six, I must say, to list uh, to play, and definitely uh, we need to really believe anything could happen. Uh, final moments of the game are possibly the most unpredictable time of the games, and no doubt uh, we expect to see. A fight to finish for both sides, and you know, for the way uh, Soldier Marines came into the game, we knew they obviously have huge potentials and can definitely take this game down to the wire. Yes, and of course, I do know that um, some of you are out there watching us. Yes, you are out there watching us. Thank you so much for watching us. Yes, certainly. Uh, 
we see your comments and we like it as well. Of course, yes, uh, you do know that you can watch us on HFN TV, on um, Facebook, and under Federation of Nigeria on YouTube. Yes, you can watch us on those ones. And of course, uh, it is 23.19 at the moment. Hmm. Of course, I see you at Golashi to at AME, at Dewumi. You said this is an interesting match. Beautiful Vigo versus experience. Ball management is key, of course, you would know because he is a coach as well. So, yes, certainly you would know as well. Obina, of course, said this is a nice game. Yes, thank you for those of you that are joining us on uh, this one, telling us um, everything that you think uh, should pan out. John Johnson, thank you very much. You said this is a nice game. Uh, Karim Z Jr. You said we we'll love you all. And of course, yes, sir. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, Mal Amidu uh, Armstrong. You said let's go, Rima, supporting your team. Yes, thank you so much for the support you're giving to your team. Usman Temidi Rebelo said Trap Lange. And of course, um, that's what you're trying to say is uh, Tojemari all the way. Sabi Uma, you even use. Hashtag um, Sokoto underscore Rima. Thank you very much for joining us on this one. Yes, and of course, yes. Things are changing because I uh, was seeing goals from Tojimari in 23 20. We still have some minutes to play in this game. Let's see whether Tojimari will be able to. You know, get back uh, that uh, maybe not advantage, but that uh, uh, capacity that they were playing. It was end to end, so uh, stuff delicately poised. Let's see whether it's going to happen. And of course, an infringement. So Jamarine trying as much as possible to see how they can do this carrying pass to Kuti. Kuti pass to Latif. Yes, and of course it went through, but then Amas Mohamed said that we have about five minutes more to play in this match. Two minutes suspension for Anas Mohamed. Anas Mohamed, yes, uh, two minutes suspension for him. Now he's the driver of this striker team. Let's see what happens in the next two minutes. Will the strikers be able to cope without him at least till the time he comes back to continue driving the team? Yes, sir. Uh, let's see what will happen. Kuti, will he score to reduce the deficit? He has. And of course, it is 23-21. Now let's see if and a Rima striker side without an ass for the next less than two minutes will be able to pull the chestnut out of the fire and maintain status quo or they would probably not continue. Yes, they did. Because was it a goal? That is what is being said. It did not enter into the net. They did enter into the net. Maybe we have to see a playback on that one pretty soon. But from where I was seeing it, I didn't see it enter into the net I didn't see it enter into the net I didn't see it enter into the net so it is 
advantage to Jamarine. It's still 23-21. And of course, strikers are insisting that it entered into the net and went out. But then, from what I saw, it was side netted from what I saw. To Jamarine, to try as much as possible to reduce the deficit. Can they do that? Yes. Two minutes suspension. Two minutes suspension for Jesse, number 33, Rima Strikers. Yes, sir. His name is Buari Bala. Oh, there was nothing that could come out from it. And of course, strikers want to see if they can wind this down. If that means. Anas Mohamed is back. They were able to hold their own till he comes back. Yes, the spine of the team. Let's see how they'll be able to work on this. And he's just he's going straight up. And of course, he's back. He's back. And the team, even with not even a complete player, are still holding their own. And of course, yes, no, they didn't get that goal. They didn't get that goal at all. Let's see. Can Toja Marine in the next less than two minutes pull the chestnut out of the fire? 28 minutes to play. Yes, about two minutes to Less play. Than two minutes to go. Let's see. Nothing of sort happened. Yes. Less than two minutes to go. Let's see. What's going to happen here? It's less than two minutes to play in this one. And of course they scored. It is 23-22. Yes, let's see if there will be a story to tell for Toje Marine in this one. We have seen dramas happen and of course sensing that uh, something might happen. Yes, and of course uh, the fact that uh, it is already getting tense. Coach Obi Fidel is called out for a timeout to see how they can be able to you know defend this one goal lead it is Rima Strikers of Sokoto 33 Toja Marine 22 Toja Marine are pumped up they want to ensure that they draw parity let's see whether it's going to work that way what I do know is that however the score comes out whether it ends in the draw, a win for striker or even to Jamarine. It is an interesting game. A game that gives very good advertisement to the Prudent Energy and Ball Premier League. Now, Rhyme, the my strikers of Sokoto, who want to wind down the time. They want to wind down the time. Now, in case you do not know, unlike football, the time will be stopped when there is a timeout or when play is not in session. Let's see how it goes. Let's see. One minute to go. Less than one minute to go. Let's see how this will pan out. Choje Marine. Less than a minute to go. How will it pan out? Well, 
The referee said there's a traveling. 30 seconds to go. Let's see how it goes. And of course, timeout called by J Marine. He said that was traveling there. This is actually turning out to be a very interesting game. <laughs> well, like, it's a dramatic uh, end. Such, such, Sam. such a dramatic end, no doubt. I think it's it's intriguing. Uh, definitely not wrecking. A red card issued to one of the players. A red card issued to one of the players of strikers. A red card issued to one of the players of strikers. That means it misses the end of this one. Number 10, Jesse player yes i think sunny oh is it number 18 it is number 10 jesse player yes it can be confirmed dan juma mohammed has been issued a red card even when it is less than 10 minutes to the end of the game now what this means is that 30 seconds to the end of the match sorry about that what this means is that it misses the end of this game now strikers for the next 30 seconds will play with a man down they will play with a man down and things are really happening Okay, a decision has been made on something which we do not know yet. Is it a seven meters? Yes, it is. A seven meters. Wow. This game is starting to about. Trust me, the two coaches would have a lot to say outside of this game. Now, let's see if the curse of the defenders against Lagos Seasiders in the morning would happen here and of course he scored 23 23 let's see how it pans out it's a fast break strikers and of course there's oh no they don't score they didn't score it is 23 23 and the fragment 30 seconds but can still not score And of course, it is the end. Is it the end? No, not yet. Not yet. Time will stop now. Less seconds to go. To Jamarine. To Jamarine. Do they have it in them? And of course, yes! They did so! Yes, they did so! And of course, they won! What really shocked me the most is uh, Daniel Bello. He became the, the he, he rose to the occasion to really rescue the team and also secure them that important comeback when it's like we started from the start. One of and split of this happening, uh, but again, it's, it's a, a, an incredible show, a great spirited display from Toje Marines. They had their their hands they left us on the edge of the of the seat and uh, almost gonna fall. I feel they weren't gonna get inside of this game, but uh, lo and behold, they're back and they ended up grabbing the maximum points on the brink. And you know, incredible display from these two teams. And uh, you must give credit to these players how they held on and stayed, maintained their composure, showed great character, and managed to upset a very strong side in Sogotorima despite several. Uh, 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 several leads they didn't join during the game at several intervals 
incredible display. They deserve this moment celebration to the night as much as they look forward to enjoying their first start on a winning note to the prudent energy handball Premier League campaign. Fantastic display so far from these teams and uh, Secretary Man definitely uh, won't have all going well with them uh, in their camp. Such a wasteful opportunity to have slumped from, uh, from, 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 from a lead and now uh, seem themselves crumble to a losing start. Incredible game and wonderful show and thank you all for you watching. We'll be enjoying every moment of this game. Wonderful show. Thank you and great evening. into the game now from whatever point of this pendulum that you can swing from yes if you are a fan of Rima strikers you will say it is a controversial end to the game but of course if you support Toji Marine Academy you will say it is a dramatic end to the game now I'm gonna start first of all with coach Bright um, Agubata right and of course yes end to the game first win it was a tough round against a very organized Rima striker side. But then, you won. Yes, I know it's going to be a tough one. Because it's a very good side. And the coach is one of the best coaches in the country. Yep. So, but I told my boys that they should just put in their best. And face because this is handball. The most important thing is putting the ball in the net and defending. So for, forget if you're coming in from Division 1. It doesn't really matter anything. You're meeting handballers, young guys like you. But I thank God by His grace, we came out victorious. So I'm happy. Okay, so Coach Fidelis, I know you have a lot to say. So it's a controversial win. You do not believe you should have lost this one. Well, it is, it is, it is well. I don't, I don't really understand the... What, uh, what is happening because I look at the game as if uh, the technical officials, the referees, I don't know whether it is a mistake they are making or I don't know whether it's the, the mistake deliberate or not. But whatever happens, I accept the truth. Okay, so still on you, next game you will do better. I know that. What is the plan? Well, uh, the, we, the game comes and goes, so we continue to put the game as they come. We will try to see. What we can do. We played well, but uh, I don't really know. You know, the players were angry because maybe the officiating was not favorable. Again. You think the officiating was not favorable? Well, as, as far as I'm concerned, as a, as a senior coach and uh, as a continental coach, yeah. we didn't play like this in the, in the Winners' Cup. Mm -hmm. So, the officiating, well, as far as I'm concerned, yeah? I don't know what is happening there. But I, it is well. Okay. No okay, just, just just so then, and of course, Coach Bright, moving forward, next game, what are your expectations? Well, the most important thing is being proactive, as in forging ahead. Okay. So I want to make sure that my prayers are in that high spirit. Okay. To face in, it's not time to relax now that we've gotten our first game, then we'll relax that every other game because we played and we won the good side, then we'll relax from all that I know. We are going to forge ahead in full force. Okay. Yeah. All right, thank you very much. And of course, our coaches, yes, it is a game. It's been long. Let's just shake on this, on this, in the spirit of sportsmanship. Thank you very much. And of course, thank you very much. You can go. And that is how we end this broadcast of the Prudent Energy and Ball League in the Velodrome. Of course, you can see it. The Velodrome, yes, a dramatic end to match the one at the Velodrome. But then there's a game going on, of course, at the um, Indoor Sport or at the Rebu Angels, the Queens, the defending champion, should be playing right about now. Why not join us? Facebook, HFN TV, YouTube, 
Handball Federation of Nigeria. My name is Cosmos Chukwemeka on behalf of um, Samuel Amadu and of course the crew of HFN TV. We say have a lovely day. Join us at the Indoor Sports Hall.